what's up guys? Sinner Soccer here for another video. In this video right here, right now I'm in Las Vegas, Nevada. I'm not by myself, now I'm with OGP and his buddy Jake Steve, which he's over there. Going to the restroom right now, but OGP's over there looking for a parking spot. Up to the Double Down Saloon over there to kick off the night. It took us forever to get over here, it was insane. It took us like seven hours to get to Vegas, which normally takes about four hours. It took us seven hours because we were stuck in traffic. It was, it was like a nightmare, like Murphy's Law of traffic night. It was insane on this 4th of July weekend, Saturday. 4th of July is on Tuesday, so it should be kind of a fun day. It's like a random one-day trip only in, in Vegas. We're gonna get some fireworks tomorrow over in Pahrump. So that should be pretty rad and pretty cool. But first off, here's the Vegas fun night. You know what I'm saying? It's pretty cool. Look at my man right here, Jake Steed. Yes! What's up? We're waiting for OGP. Hey, we'll record the bum right there. sleeping. It's a bum? Right? There's a homeless guy? Bum? Right? I'll put the light on there. Never know in Vegas. Let's, let's go see what's going on. It's weak. There's a guy sleeping right now over here. There's a dude. Oh my god. Or it could be a dead body. We don't even know what this is. So no, it could no. be anything. But it took us. I was telling them it took us forever to get up here. Oh, it was, it was horrible. It was a nightmare. It was, a total it was crazy. Bummer. Yeah. And this guy right here, Jake. See, he knows OGP from the videos. Yes. He knows some videos. This is my very first time meeting him. Really cool guy. He got some ink done ten, earlier today. Can't really see it, but it's, it's right there. Some nice new ink. Yes. And so, but now we're finally here. Ready to get drunk. Double down saloon with some of the. Uh, but you might get the ass juice. What you oh, I'm about? getting the ass juice. The legendary ass juice I'm shot that comes that. in the toilet. So I'm totally getting that. You got to do it with the toilet shot Everything. bowl. It's pretty rad. So a little bit OGP will make his way over here because now he's trying to find a spot to park in. There's the Double Down Saloon and we're saying you can smell the marijuana because oh, yeah. marijuana just got legal here in Nevada uh, today, July 1st, I believe, right? Yes, yeah. It just got, yes. Oh my God, you can smell the dank right now. It's like, I need to get some dank. the dude right there, he's like, he's like smoking the dank, I think. He's like smoking it up. So he's like, so he's there, they're doing like the smoke smoke because like it's all legal now need to get in Nevada. So I don't know. It's kind of interesting. So a lot of things going on this weekend. Fourth of July weekend, marijuana is now legal. And so yes, we're now hit up this place. A good old classic, double down slew with icy beer, boozy drinks, and good things like that. Oh, piece of the video now. I'm in, oh, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in, I am over there. Yeah, because you had to park the car, so it was a hassle oh, find parking. It, 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 it was crazy. It was a mess. It was, it was a mess. nuts. It was nuts. It was like yeah. insane. I do have some. Unbelievable, man. Everyone's like, everyone's like smoking marijuana over here. Yeah, it's well, a dispensary we're by over the there, dispensary right? right over there. Oh my gosh, no wonder everyone's smoking marijuana. Yeah. So it's crazy. It makes sense. It's now we can finally drink beer now. We're gonna drink some beer now. Let's do right it now. I just realized this, this is called the Grove Dispensary. I didn't know this is a dispensary, and everyone's here to get their their, their dank on. Oh, yeah. Right next to Double Down. So it's a wonder everyone was smoking weed over there because like. It's like, it's like, it's by right here, right? That's right. Oh my God, how crazy is that? Interesting stuff. So now we're inside the marijuana dispensary because all of the, the weed they got over here, like all the, the rolled stuff, they can get pre-rolled and things like that. And it's like a menu right here, like edible or and, and things like that. So we're just walking in here. Let's check it out because it's got legal today. So it's kind of funny to check it out. This is kind of funny, I think, and kind of neat. <laughs> like all the edibles and stuff they got going in here, like, Rice Krispie treats with like something else added to it, things like that. Like it's a trip. Like I don't know, <laughs> pretty rad. Like all kinds of like different things like that. Like concentrate right there. And, like all different kinds of you get. Yeah, that's like, crazy. Super lemon haze. And strawberry pin and everything else. Like it's like a bunch of different stuff. Man. This is like a really big, big place. It's like everyone's getting their getting their smoke on. It's more of the weed again. Like. Velvet elements and all this stuff is all right there. It's like, what? I don't know. Crazy stuff. Star Killer, huh? This is like a good science fiction movie, but it's not that. You know, like hats here and shirts and stuff like that you can get here. And like little, like, I don't know, like, it's the gold standard, they say, right here. Right over here. Gold standard, folks. Go in this line, you buy whatever you want in this line right here. It's like, that's how you do it. Even my man Jake Steed said it's almost like a McDonald's menu the way it looks. And it kind of is, that's a good way to put it. It's like a total McDonald's menu. It's like this right there. It's a McDonald's menu. Oh man. We just left the Grove dispensary. I don't know if we bought anything. Maybe, I don't know. He bought, Jake Steed bought something. He bought something. But it's called Candyland. Candyland. I'm not, I'm not going to have any, of course not. I'm not going to have none. He's gonna have some. I'm not gonna have oh, yeah, none. No. Oh yeah, yeah. I don't do that stuff. We go to the bar first, huh? So now we're at the Double Down Saloon. I'm gonna get the Olympia beer. Oh yeah, it's a classic Olympia. The Double Down. We got a lot of pretty cool places. Weird stuff like that. Oh yeah. That is so cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
with all kinds of like band stickers things. Put it with all kinds of band stickers. How oh, awesome is that? Good, delicious Olympia beer. I love Olympia beer. It tastes so good. It's such a cool place. Like, you can't go wrong. It's awesome. Just left double down, so we're going to head over to the hotel now. It's about 1 o'clock in the morning and actually check in there, maybe buy some beers before we go in there. Right now it's like, it's hot as hell outside right now. It's like 91 degrees out right now here. Because this friggin' what? It's like, it's like 91, it's like 91 it's degrees out. It's hot as hell. 91 degrees, it's I thought it's hot as hell. 91 degrees We've been drinking. at 1 in the morning. I said, I said we'd go to the hotel probably and finally check in. Our ears are fucking ringing. It's it so loud in there. So loud that damn Such place. Such a cool place. Oh, God, I, I love, love that. Place. I love it's Double Down. So this whole area oh. is so cool. We got like this marijuana dispensary, some weird club <laughs> over there. Did you have any weird. ass juice? I didn't I drink no ass juice. You're, this guy right probably, here, yeah, yeah, I had a shot, took a shot of ass juice. You're, you're, you're probably juice. better off without it. It's I know. It's the greatest. The thing it's is like, greatest. no one knows it's Sunday ass juice. No one knows it's like no, mystery, it's a mystery drink. Mystery it's juice. Mystery drink, so it actually so. could be actually ass juice. <laughs> really from the might, other. It really, it yeah, might I don't be know, like maybe. Swamp ass juice. It might be swamp Ooh. ass juice. It's gross. Look at these hot winds. So now we're going to try to get some like, maybe some of the, the Colt 45 yes, pile driver, maybe. Pile driver. Maybe. Yes, yes. If they have it, if not, we'll make old school. We'll do a brass monkey. We'll, old we'll, school we'll, brass monkeys. We'll fall back. Either the way. Old, old, the old uh, faithful. Either right. way, it'll happen. So, yeah. next stop will be at the liquor store getting the, the, the stuff. Fuck yeah. The hotel I'll check in. It's about 1 30 in the morning. Kind of a weird area where we're at. It's like downtown Vegas, kind of, kind of like in the weird, kind of crappy part of Vegas we're staying at. Look at this wonderful artwork right here. Check out this cool artwork. What is this? Look at this weird artwork. Look at this like it's like it's like a crackhead light display right here. What what is this? With a lovely bottle down there. And like some weird like band thing over here. Like what is this? Like, can you see that? Like this weird truck right over there. And like it's called oh it's called this I guess this is our this is our last chance. Which ain't a good thing. But it's just a weird ass little place. It's over here right by Fremont. We're like, we're like about three blocks away from Fremont. It's just in the outskirts of Fremont. And look at these like weird like things, like these like like wires and connectors and stuff. Look at this, look at this stuff. Just tripped out. These like weird like these creepy looking baby face. Look at these things. Like, what is this? Look at these, these baby doll faces. There's like this weird picture, like this, this dude's face is all jacked up. Tripped out. So we're just going down here. Got Jake Steed over there, OGP. Yeah, right over there, you got the weird mural. We kind of can see it. it's kind of dark. Wild. We're at the wild. Shit's about to get wild up in here. It's about to get shit's about to get wild. Check this out. We're at the wild. This tripped out looking place. It's like I think it's like a lion head. I saw like a statue or something. <laughs> it's a big Is there a lion head? Right, I saw. There was. Yes, a gigantic lion right here. Oh, oh, shit. What is that? Oh shit. Okay. You see something like that? You know it's kind of cool, right? Just saying, it's kind of cool. Oh, oh look at the way the carpet. It's, it's, like, it's like miniature golf carpeting right here. Meow, meow. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> it's getting wild. Look at this. It's like a miniature golf. It's like, it's like AstroTurf. Like, for, like 1980s AstroTurf for football yeah, it smells, fields. It smells like it's like a bamboo. 1970s fucking. <laughs> That's the most weirdest hotel. A uh, hallway I've been to in my life. Bamboo in the walls. And like AstroTurf right there. <laughs> You gotta love it, folks. Vegas style. Here's our, here's our room. Oh my gosh. We're getting cozy up in this bitch. We, we got one room for three for three men. It's going down tonight. Oh my it's going down tonight. Oh my god, dude. Look at this. Right there, folks. Oh man. We have one. Let me see. I have a TV. I got the sleeping bag right here. Oh my god. The bathroom's just just a regular, you know, like, bathroom. TV's as big as a room. Is, yeah. That's badass, dude. <laughs> this, is, this is hilarious. <laughs> Alright, so now we're leaving the room, and it smells like the zoo in here. It literally smells like the San Diego Zoo in this place. And uh, we're gonna hit up the uh, liquor store, grab a drink and a snack. Alright, so now we're getting the essentials right here for a brass monkey, because before we're we gonna go. get a pile driver by Cool Fruit Grab, which is like a brass monkey in the can that I'm having now, it's sold out. But. We'll, we'll do it like that, you know what I'm saying? Which is now 42 ounces. 42. So it's not 40s, it's not 42s, bro. Do this brass monkey right now. Jake Cedar has Where the brass drinking? monkey looking. Looks like nice brass monkey style. Ooh. We're here by Fremont Street, by this weird artwork uh -oh. and inter interesting lights we got right Look at these lights. What is that? I don't know what's going on, but it's perfect per to drink this. So, so we got the orange juice right there. 
We're gonna drink some of this so we can put some of that in there. That's what we do. Going down. Up by Fremont Street. It's going down. Up two o'clock in the morning. That's what we do. Here we go. Mm. Wow. OE is uh it's not quite as tasty as is the OE. Man, mom, it's not, it's not, it's not like it's not. It's not like my hazy IPAs I get, or that I get. It's not like those hazy IPAs I get. This is that malt liquor OE piss taste. Plus, it didn't help that I ate a bunch of candy on the way over here. Here we go, right here. A little that. A little. Look at that, huh? 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 That funky monkey. That funky monkey. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that loveliness. Look at that. It's almost like a hazy IPA, but it's not a quality of a hazy IPA. I'm time to drink this up right now. I love it because it's like we're drinking this in the freaking corner of this weird thing by this at two in the morning or so by this area. It's so like it's like the weird vibe. It's so it's so cool and just kind of funny, you know what I'm saying? This is kind of a trip. So now time for the brass monkey with a 42 of that. Here we go. Tastes a lot better. Tastes a lot better. The brass yeah. monkey is a lot better. Is that, it, it's a lot easier to a lot easier swallow. Easier to taste more straight. like yes, because it's always kind of a grossy malt liquor. You guys gotta understand, we're not pusses. No, but we've been drinking like light beer all night. And you get this and malt then we, liquor. And we had candy. Yes. And so Hold on. it's making this. It's making it's it's making it, and it's not that cold. It's entered Fremont area. You get this weird structure, which we know just went here before at the Container Park place. We came here out in the rain that one time. That place! That was the place we went to. There was right a rain there. outside and stuff right over there like two years ago. It's been a while, yeah. It's been a while since it's been this. It's been a while. It's been a while. But it's cool. Let's look at these brass monkeys right now entering like a, this area. Brass monkeys. Kill it. Kill right it. there, right there. Right there, put it down. Yeah, I thought it was all value you now. Too much, a little too fast. Busy as hell right now, dude. Look at those brass monkeys like no other, you know? Brass monkeys. We're keeping it hood. Is that what I'm talking about? Keep, keep it real. Keeping it real. Right here, is that good, right? That's good, right? That's, yeah. That's a damn good thing right there. Look at that. Look at that. Put the low toe. There you go. Low. Look at that. Bam. 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 Right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. Six, six, one, nine. There, there, there it is. There you go, huh? All right, so now is the next day. We're just leaving the wild. It was a fun night. Had some brass monkeys on, hey, the, on the Fremont Street. Fun good times. times. It was, it was awesome. Good times. It is hot as hell out right now. It's toasty. Woo, 100 and some because, you know, it's Vegas. You know, so yeah. it's, expect that. So now it's going to be a fun day because we're going to hit up the, uh, the firework area of Pahrump. Yeah. Yeah. It's like about five or so uh, firework shops. That's my side to check that out. Yeah. And then that's what we're going to do. And then uh, let's go do that right now. We're headed to Pahrump right now. And it's almost like we're going to Area 51. It looks like the same scenery. Yes. Way middle out here. Of nowhere. We have way out here. And just check this out though. Pretty cool. There's nothing out here. Pretty awesome. Pretty big mountains coming out here. Yeah, there is. Yeah, look at that. These crazy mountains way out there. That, that man. So here we are in Pahrump. It's like this little dust storm, little thing going on over there. Uh, all the fireworks are up there a little bit more. So here is the Perup now, the another, another fireworks shop. Check it out. There's several in this area, but I'm just gonna kind of check it out and see what we have in here. Just look at it. A red apple fireworks. It's pretty cool. That's cool, man. It's pretty cool. There's like right several there. of them in this whole area. There's like probably eight fireworks places. Check this out, man. It's nuts. Orders right here for sale. These, these, these are always good because they like, they like, uh, they blow up. They're like really cool. These are really cool. Right here. These are awesome. All kinds of fireworks. Look at this. It's like. It's rows and rows and aisles of firework madness. This one's right here, you're gonna let it smack down with this. Like a wrestling ring finale setup. That is pretty cool. Check that out. That is pretty rad. And for me, this is kind of cool for OGP because, like, being from California, uh, fireworks are illegal except the safe and sane ones up in Orange County. You can get those, but if you wanna get the good stuff like this, the aerial blow up, you know, the things that blow up and stuff. You can't get into California, so it's really cool to see this stuff here and rare you need to check out. That's why we like trip out of it. It's kind of cool. Like, when I get the goods like that, like that, 
You have to go to Nevada to get that stuff, a place that had to, you know, a place where it's legal at. Left this first fireworks shop, I didn't even get anything in there, just like looking around, and because the line was like huge. Insane. It was like that an line hour was away. Insane. It was crazy. So we should have some other ones around here. It's like, about six or seven around this area. So, so. Let's see what they got. Yeah. All right, fireworks shop number two over here. Black Jack Fireworks. Went to this place a long time ago, years ago. I bought fireworks here and at Phantom before. I still actually still have fireworks in my house from that time, from like eight years ago or something. Wow. Crap. So wow. that's last time I was in Pahrump. Was like that Those could be ago. dangerous now. They might have kind of decayed what? right away. You exactly. So we're going to go Add in there. to the adventure. It will. So, but, but, uh, except I don't want to miss no fingers. Be like this. I'd be kind of, <laughs> I'd be pretty sucky. But Jake Steed's already in there. He's got his firework on. Let's go Wheels inside. Of firecrackers. Look at these things. Damn, look at these guys. These guys weigh like, guys are kind of heavy too, man. Look how cool this. Ninja firecrackers, maximum force, big slew firecrackers. Wow. That's pretty, so you buy this, you get two of them for free. Wow, wow. These are cool, check these out. These are cool, look at these, look at these dude. These look awesome looking. Those look pretty rad. The logo looks really freaking cool. Like the, I can like the, the blue like foil. These ones are called Bacon Bombs. That's kind of like the name of that. It's like a weird name, Bacon Bombs. <laughs> That's hilarious. All kinds of stuff here, man. It's crazy, There's right? Lot. There's a lot. Here. There's so a rad. Because the other place, place I first went to did not have firecrackers. I didn't see none in there, really. I didn't see any firecrackers. I saw big stuff. This one has like firecrackers. Yeah. M60s. Yeah. Oh, you're going okay, go. to get some goodies. M200s. Oh, yeah. Nice and loud. Like, boom. Oh, Third firework shop is Phantom Fireworks. Yeah. This place is good. A lot of good Ooh. stuff in here. But it's a place I bought a bunch at years ago. So, let's check it out. Look at these sets, holy crap, man, those are huge. Look at this, for 1500 bucks, you got a gigantic, huge thing. Maybe a, it's like a crazy firework enthusiast. That last firework store, check it out, is this Area 51 fireworks. I mean, we went to the real Area 51, aliens. the gate, and now the aliens have followed us again, but alien things go on with us. Area 51 fireworks at this place right here. Look at this thing. That is a really cool sign, check it out. That's awesome. So, check this out right now. Like a little alien guy right there. A little alien, like, uh, things up there. That's pretty rad, man. Gigantic. We gonna enter the Area 51 OGP? Head down here. Let's go inside. 51. Whoa, this is what it is. That's a lot, man. Oh really weird. Check these out. Look at these little, look at these chickens with a balloon out of its butt. Oh my what is, god. What is this? <laughs> Chicken blowing a balloon. So you blow it this, Tell the chicken to and it, blow it, out it, its it ass. blows out its ass. Blow it out the ass. I mean, that is, another, I've never seen this before in my life. Organic firecrackers. M5000. I thought M80s and M100s okay, were this, huge. These are taking a hundred of the level. This is like blocking his whole freaking hand. That's like as big as your hand. Jesus, look at this thing in the bottom, too. Oh look at that. Oh, it's oh like, six, like a big finale. 16,000 oh firecrackers. Dude, check, out, check out how big this thing is. Look at that, dude. Oh my god, it's crazy huge. That's amazing. And you notice this one over here. This one. <laughs> this one says, it says fuck the police. Yeah. And it's like the Grim Reaper with like the middle finger right there on the package itself. Yeah. That's pretty hilarious. <laughs> that's, that's like I gotta I gotta record that. That's oh, pretty yeah. cool. It's like I never seen that. That's that's nuts. Check out these horror themed works you pointed out. I even see this. This is amazing. There's Leatherface, Kong, Freddy Krueger on that sucker. That is awesome. And down here you get Jason. That's rad, dude. It's like a line of these guys too right here. Look at that. That is really cool. All right, so we left Pahrump like a couple hours ago. My man a here, hours ago. St Jake Steed, he yeah. got some fireworks over fireworks. there in the back. He got and some like nice happened? ones. And then what happened? <laughs> bum, bum, bum. <laughs> In the middle of nowhere, right? The yeah, car's getting hot. It's getting really hot, so we had to give yeah, it a break. That's what it was. So we had a break. It didn't overheat, but the temperature got up there. Yes. It's like a warning thing. It's fucking 109 degrees. Yeah. And we're fucking camping out. <laughs> oh my god! Look at this. Up by the Joshua trees. Oh, look at this. We got sleeping bags on. We got, sleep, we got sleeping bags. We got some pork rinds. I got some hot water and some Fritos, so we can oh, survive sure. for like yeah, for like a little bit, but not, but not that long. But uh. But that's pretty much the end of the video right here. Hey, what well, else we, are you gonna do? Because we're, we actually were gonna blow up a, a cool firework he picked up, an yes. M5000, this big old Jumbo. But we have no lighter. No, have those fireworks right there, those M5000s and stuff, and those ones you want to blow up, but we can't do it right now. Fire. Also, so, lighter, I'm not looking for Murphy's lighter. Law, right? Yeah. This is like Murphy's Law. Whatever can go wrong, can yeah, and this, will with us this, this trip. trip, man. Oh my god. Lady, Long Luck, lines. Lady Luck was not on her side. No, it wasn't. <laughs> Long lines. <laughs> 
it took forever, traffic. dude. Yes, dude. A couple times. Oh my god. And and, and dude, I lost my ass at the poker table in Vegas. <laughs> like I mean, oh like, man, unbelievable. Name, like, like nothing. All this happened right? in twenty four hours, this, too. All within twenty four hours. It's yes. this. Oh. oh my god, dude. Like, oh, uh, but it's an, so hopefully we'll be okay and we'll get out of here. So this right. In the video, make sure to check out my man, which be on his channel. Link down below, of course. Yep. Awesome, hanging out with Jake Steed right there. Yep. Blow shit bam. Up. Blow, we're trying blow to. Shit up. We're trying to blow shit up. We're about to get a lens and like use like the reflector off the sunlight yeah. to <laughs> spark up a fuse. Yep. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up, leave a comment below, and hopefully we survive. And yeah, that's right. Hopefully you get to watch this. Hopefully get to watch it. So, because <laughs> yeah. there is no one out here, as you can see. Hear that? A whole lot of nothing. And I'll catch you later next one time. I'll see you. Hopefully, hopefully I will.